the competition with the biggest tradition, the most famous competition for particularly cello uh, in the world. And that reputation is a big weight on everyone. I think we should all be responsible, the contestants, but also the jury, to make very responsible decisions because we are in St. Petersburg, in one city with a great musical tradition and a very high level of music making. And that definitely keeps the standard very high for the competition too. There's a tradition of people winning this competition and going into the world and making great careers and inspiring many people. If you win the Tchaikovsky competition, you have a big chance to um, be part of the musical life of the future in the world. It's not done because there are many uh, responsibilities for an artist uh, besides winning a competition uh, to build an audience to sustain musical quality on a very high level and other aspects, but it is a big support. So this competition really supports young artists in a very intensive and very meaningful way. We have um, in each competition, of course, quality differences, but that's also a beautiful thing because it will help the players who are maybe not advancing to hear that there are other players who have mastered the instrument even more and have maybe even more musical fantasy or you know, uh, beauty of sound, taste. And all these aspects, I think, um, when many talents come together, they kind of inspire each other and they show to each other where the future is. In general, uh, a musician who wants to uh, live in this musical world and sustain a musical career, it's, you have to have um, a lot of musical imagination, a lot of technical command, taste, um, intelligence and I feel lots of emotions of course.